Hey guys, this is Leah with Scott Leroy Marketing, and in today's tip video, I'm going to show you how you can download your forms, whether they are in DocuSign in your room or in your opportunity. So what this tip video is on specifically is how to download the forms that you already have signed. Uh, maybe so you want to download your file to your computer. Okay, I'm going to show you how to do that, whether your file is in your opportunity, in command, or in DocuSign. So first I'll start off in command at agent.kw.com, and that's where I am here. Again, that's agent.kw.com. We'll go ahead and come over to the opportunity. And right, so however, however you typically access your opportunity, whether it's from the contact record directly, from all opportunities, or from the pipeline, go ahead and navigate to locate your opportunity. All right, so I'm going to access mine from the pipeline, so I'll go ahead and click on the pipeline to open that up, and simply click on one of the opportunity names to open that further. All right, so again, to get into the opportunity details section, you simply click on the name of the opportunity, and that will open that up. And feel free to pause the video so you can locate your opportunity before we continue. So once you've located your opportunity, and again, click on the name of the opportunity to open that, we'll wanna go ahead and click on the document section. Okay, so the documents tab. That would show you the files, so the forms that you had submitted to your office staff for compliance review. So if your transaction coordinator did it for you, or you just wanna go ahead and download a backup, of all of your forms to your computer, you can actually do that by clicking the this uh sorry it's this little box here with an arrow coming out of it. So on the left hand side, you should see that checklist name, right? And then it should show you all of the form names along with the attached file. So you can see the difference, right? This one I have an, an attached file. These I do not yet, right? But it would allow me to download all of the forms in this file by clicking on the box with an up arrow coming out of it. You can go ahead and edit this information here. So if you wanna protect the documents with credentials, you can do that, which is pretty cool. Or you can go ahead and export all documents, including um, all version history. So if you wanna go ahead and select which forms you wanna go ahead and export, so is it just your listing file or is it you know all three, your listing under contract and closed file, you can go ahead and select that. Oh, pretty cool, and if you click on the um, arrow right here, it'll actually drop that down and you could select that manually further from here. I'll show you all the forms that are on that a checklist that you have and again these are these are created by your office staff so yours will look different than mine but no worries all right but clicking this option right here will export all of those okay, and note that you can also switch these options at the top in case you're not finding all of your forms but selecting the checkbox here should select all of those and you can click export All right, your export is processing and you will receive a notification with a link to download the archive when the processing is complete. So where that will display is actually in the check in the sorry, the bell icon on the very top right of command. You'll see a notification that actually mine already came through. So I can go ahead and click to download it. And that actually downloads as a zip file. This up a little. So this is the zip file it came over in. So if I click on that, you know, depending on what your computer has, my computer will unzip that file for me when I go to open it. And you can go ahead and access all of those files in a folder right on your computer. So pretty cool feature here. You know, after downloading that, I would just suggest maybe going to your downloads and moving that zip file to another spot on your computer where you might know where you're keeping that. Okay, and in the next section of the tip, I'm just going to show you if you have your forms in DocuSign uh, directly, I will show you how you can export your forms directly from DocuSign to your computer if need be. So I am logging in to DocuSign and I'm logging in at realestate.docusign.com. 
Okay, again, that's realestate.docusign.com, just to put that at the top for you. That'll be specifically your KW DocuSign account, DocuSign Rooms account. And to go ahead and export any forms that you have in your DocuSign room, let's go ahead and open that form, or open that room rather. So open your DocuSign room and select the Documents tab in your DocuSign room. Okay, at this point, of course, feel free to pause the video so you can go find your room as well. And then we would be able to either download forms one at a time. And the way you would do that is by hovering over the document that you would like to go ahead and download. So if I do that, if I hover my mouse over that document, I'll see a little dot on the top left, which would go ahead and select the form. And right when I select a form, this bulk actions menu will appear at the top. So this, these icons will not appear until you check a form. All right, but this will allow you to go ahead and download the form. So the download icon looks like a down arrow. Okay, and if I click on that, it will download the form. All right, so you can also select multiple. So you can click select all on the very top right to select all forms in your DocuSign room. So again, that's on the top right of the Documents tab. Click Select All and click the Download option. It will show you all the forms that it's downloading and you can actually click the X on the right hand side to get rid of any that maybe you don't want in here. And click Download. And same concept here is Command that will also create a zip file on your computer. If you're not familiar with what a zip file is, it's basically just if it's a really big file, your computer will zip them all together so they can, com they can be combined into one file when it gets downloaded. And then typically com your computer will have a um, software built in that will unzip any files. So I can tell it's a zip file because it ends in zip. If I click on it from my downloads, okay, however you want to go ahead and get there, I can see in my downloads, here are all the forms all in one zip folder, so again, I can go to my downloads and move this file, this folder, wherever I would like to store all of my documents and all of my backups. Hey right, guys, so if you have any questions on that, please let us know. Feel free to email support at scottlaroymarketing.com. Um, there would not be a way that we've seen to do this from all opportunities or all DocuSign rooms at once with one click. So you would just have to go into each DocuSign room or each opportunity to download the forms or file from there. If you have any questions, just let us know. Thanks. Have a good one.